Hey guys, Miguel again from Cloud Technology, and this video is going to be about how you can choose the right DTF printer for you, and how you can pretty much make a decision on what printer you should buy from our website, depending on your needs, right? So we're going to start off with the most popular printer. This is the printer that comes up as soon as you look up uh, DTF printing. And I'm talking about the Epson L1800, or as we call it here, the McLeod 1300, the MP1300. So this printer is a, uh, basically it's an Epson based printer, so it has an Epson head and it prints on DTF sheets rather than the rolls. Um, and basically, uh, it allows you to mostly preview your designs. Uh, and the reason why I say that is because this printer, while it does print in a high resolution and it does print out consistently and it is really reliable, it prints at a slow pace. So this printer is more for a personal use, like if you like to make your own t-shirts or if you wanna make t-shirts for a small group or if you're just a designer who wants to see what your designs look like when you put them on a shirt, right? This is not gonna be for a 24 hour production plan or even an eight hour production plan like a full work day. This is mostly just for a personal use or if you have a business that has a designer, they can have their own printer and they can print out uh, their own transfers before they send it out to the rest of the team. This is basically mostly what that printer is for. We sell uh, consumables for this printer that are about the size, so 100 milliliters, uh, 250, 500, you can go all the way up to a liter, um, but yeah, so like this is basically the printer that most people like to start off on uh, when they're starting off the DTF. Now the next printer here is when people start getting a lot more serious. So this is the 1710. The 1710 prints at a lot faster speed, so this can churn out a good amount of uh, transfers every day. I would say probably around 10 to 20 transfers an hour. Um, the thing is though, is that it's it's 17 inches, right? So if you want to print more transfers side by side, or if you want to print out um, a lot of transfers on the same sheet, maybe this won't be the printer for you either because, uh, like I said, it does print fast, it's just you're limited by the size of the, of the film, right? This also takes a roll, it can take sheets as well, uh, whichever one you'd like, um, and that's the advantage that it has over the 1300, right? That it can take a film, a, a, a roll of film versus a sheet of film. So you can print a lot more and continuously without having to babysit the printer and having to feed more paper, right? So once people get accustomed to this one or if they need more uh, you know, printing use out of it, then move on to our industrial printers, right? So our industrial printers are the 2410s. This is the bread and butter of DTF. This is the bread and butter of the cloud technology. This is the flagship model, the, the, the highest model that we offer currently. So this printer is 24 inches long. And this printer is by far going to be the one that prints out the most and the most consistently and pretty much for the longest period of time. So this printer can turn out 30 to 40 transfers an hour depending on uh, what colors and what size the transfers are. But if it's going to be square, uh, one square foot, it's going to be about 30 transfers an hour. Um, this is our fastest printer. This is also our smartest printer. So this one you can put automatic uh, head cleaning every once in a while. Um, you can, uh, it basically requires the least amount of maintenance out of all of our printers, just because the most maintenance you'll have to do is have to shake the, the inks and then do a, a power cleaning or a normal cleaning every day. But then that's it, right? Um, everything goes in the maintenance tank. There is a spit box or a flushing box, so it can continuously print over and over and over all day without any problems. But yeah, like that's basically the difference is the capacity, the volume, and how much you're printing. So if you're more of a designer, you want to go to 1300. If you're more of a small business owner and you want to just get out there in the world of DTF, the 1710. And if you want, if you're a serious uh, DTF transfer uh, seller, or if you're serious about making your t-shirt business grow, I would highly suggest the uh, 2410, or even the 2400, which is a smaller compact version of this uh, printer, but the 2410 definitely. In the future, we might release a 44 inch printer, but you know, that, that's for another video, right? So, uh, like I said guys, those are the main differences between each one of these printers. Next week I'll be making a video going more in depth about the printers, but um, if you'd like to know more, I'd really reach out to our sales team, especially our sales manager, Reed. He's a great guy. He'll definitely let you guys know what's the best printer for you. And uh, that's pretty much it, guys. So I hope you have a good night, and uh, yeah, make sure to visit our website. Take it easy.